Air power has increasingly become a powerful element of military campaign. Military planners view having an environment of at least air superiority as a necessity. Air superiority is the single most important factor in deciding the outcome of a modern conventional war. It ensures quicker victories and perhaps prevents war in the first place. So let's have a look at the best active air superiority fighters in the world today. Number 8 on the list for the top air superiority fighter is the Chengdu J-20. This is a single-seat twin-jet all-weather stealth developed by China's Chengdu Aerospace Corporation for the People's Liberation Army Air Force. Powered with two Saturn AL-31 FM-2, it provides a maximum speed of 3,149 km per hour, combat range of 2,000 km and a service ceiling of 20,000 meters. The J-20 is designed as an air superiority fighter with precision strike capability that descends from the JXX program of the 1990s. This aircraft is a competent aircraft for the People's Liberation Army Air Force having a low radar cross-section. The main weapon bay is capable of housing both short- and long-range air-to-air missiles, while the two smaller lateral weapon bays behind the air inlets are intended for short-range AAMs. At number 7, we have the Eurofighter Typhoon. This is a European twin-engine Canada Delta Wing air superiority fighter. It is a highly agile aircraft designed to be a supremely effective dogfighter in combat. It is powered with a pair of Eurojet EJ-200 afterburning turbofan engines and it has a maximum speed of 2,125 km per hour, combat radius of 1,389 km and can fly at a maximum altitude of 19,812 meters. This aircraft has been increasingly better equipped to undertake air-to-surface strike missions and to be compatible with an increasing number of different armaments and equipments including Storm Shadow and Brimstone missiles. Although not designated as a stealth fighter, measures were taken to reduce the Typhoon's radar cross-section, especially from the frontal aspect. At number 6 is the Sukhoi SD-30 MKI. This is a twin-jet multi-role air superiority fighter developed by Russia's Sukhoi and built under license by India's HAL for the Indian Air Force. Powered with a pair of Lulka AL-31FP afterburning turbofan engines, it provides a maximum speed of 2,120 km per hour, combat range of 1,500 km and service ceiling of 17,300 meters. The Su-30 MKI is a highly integrated twin-finned aircraft. The Su-30 MKI, while based on an air superiority airframe, is equally capable in strike role and ship hunting roles as an air-to-air -air combat. The fighter's most prominent strike capability comes from its access to Brahmos cruise missiles, an Indian-Russian joint platform capable of striking targets at a speed of up to Mach 3 and disabling most warships with a single well-placed strike. The fifth most powerful air superiority fighter in the world today is the Mikoyan MiG-29 or the Fulcrum. This is a twin-engine jet multi-role air superiority fighter aircraft mainly used by the Russian Aerospace Forces. It is powered with a pair of Klimov RG-33 turbofans which ensures a maximum speed of 2,400 km per hour, a combat range of 710 km and a service ceiling of 18,000 meters. While originally oriented towards combat against any enemy aircraft, many MiG-29s have been furnished as multi-role fighters capable of performing a number of different operations and are commonly outfitted to use a range of air-to-surface armaments and precision munitions. The very agile R-73 missile remains widely viewed as the best close combat air-to-air -air weapon. However, the MiG-29's primary beyond visual range weapon, the R-27, is no more than adequate. Number 4 on this list is the Sukhoi Su-27 or the Flanker. This is a twin-engine, super-maneuverable fighter aircraft designed by Sukhoi. It was intended as a direct competitor for the large United States fourth-generation fighters such as the Grumman F-14 Tomcat with 1,500 km combat range, 2,500 km per hour speed, heavy aircraft ordnance, sophisticated avionics, and high maneuverability. The Su-27 was designed for air superiority missions and subsequent variants are able to perform almost all aerial warfare operations. 
Its heavy armament of up to 10 air-to-air -air missiles gives excellent combat persistence, outstanding maneuverability coupled with a helmet sight to kill agile R-73 missiles also makes it a potent close combat fighter. Up next at number 3, we have the McDonnell Douglas F-15 Eagle. This is an American twin-engine all-weather tactical fighter aircraft designed by McDonnell Douglas. Powered with a pair of Pratt & Whitney F-100 PW-220 afterburning turbofans, it gives a maximum speed and combat range of 2,655 km per hour and 1,965 km. It can fly up to a maximum altitude of 20,000 meters. The F-15 Eagle was originally envisioned as a pure air superiority aircraft where its design included a secondary ground attack capability. The USAF introduced the F-15 as the first dedicated USAF air superiority fighter since the North American F-86 Sabre. The F-15 has a look-down, shoot-down radar that can distinguish low-flying moving targets from ground clutter. At number 2, we have the Sukhoi Su-35, also known as Flanker E. It is the designation for two improved derivatives of the Su-27 air defense fighter, which is single-seat, twin-engine, super-maneuverable air superiority aircraft designed by Sukhoi for the Russian Air Force. Its speed and combat range are 2,400 km per hour and 1,600 km. The Su-35 is primarily an air superiority fighter, however, it has secondary air-to-ground capability. It can carry enormous amount of weapons, it has 12-wing and fuselage hardpoints and can carry ordnance with a maximum weight of up to 8,000 kg. It poses a great threat to Western 4-plus generation fighters such as Eurofighter Typhoon, the Salt Rafale, F-15C or F-A-18E Super Hornet. However, it is no match for American F-22 Raptor due to its stealthiness. At number 1 is none other than the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor. This is an American single-seat, twin-engine, all-weather stealth tactical fighter aircraft developed for the United States Air Force. The result of the USAF's Advanced Tactical Fighter Program, the aircraft was designed primarily as an air superiority fighter but also has ground attack, electronic warfare, and signal intelligence capabilities. It is the first operational aircraft to combine supercruise, supermaneuverability, stealth, and sensor fusion in a single weapons platform. The F-22's high cruise speed and operating altitude over prior fighters improved the effectiveness of its sensors and weapon systems and increased survivability against ground defenses such as surface-to-air missiles. The F-22's aerodynamics, relaxed ability, and powerful thrust vectoring engines gives it excellent maneuverability and energy potential across its flight envelope. Hence, it is the most powerful air superiority fighter aircraft in the world. With this, we've come to the end of the video. If you've liked this video, don't forget to share and let everyone know the power and importance of air superiority fighters. Thank you guys for viewing and bye-bye.